folks, it looks like John Reynolds and the first corps are about ready to arrive here pretty soon. And you will notice that they do have corps flags. Each of the seven corps in the Union Army of Potomac, approximately 10,000 men each, had their own particular identifying emblem that the soldiers would wear. So the commanding general would ride up and see that emblem on a soldier. He'd know exactly whose soldiers that was. Just so happens that the first corps here at Gettysburg, John Reynolds, their corps emblem, was a circle or full moon. Now you can tell which division of the corps that's being represented by the color of the circle. Usually there were two to three divisions within a corps. First division would be red. A red circle, a red diamond, a red Maltese cross indicating first division of that corps. White would be second division. And blue would be the third division. So folks here, if you look off to the right, you can begin to see a white flag with a red circle indicating the first division of the first corps. And actually the first brigade of the first division of the first corps is arriving on the field, the Iron Brigade, perhaps the most famous brigade in the Union Army of Potomac, the only all Western troops in the Union Army of Potomac. These fellows are not from California, Arizona, New uh, Mexico, Washington, or Oregon. They are from what we consider the Midwest today, primarily Wisconsin, Indiana, and a new unit, the 24th Michigan. Major General John Fulton Reynolds. Someone